happy weekend everyone it sounded like happy new year then <laughs> um i'm just jumping on quickly because um i've just done another run um and this is not about running um but maybe you've been pondering on something or maybe you've got like a clear goal in your mind and you're struggling to get started so i just wanted to say that there's always going to be a bit of a pain point when you start on something that you've been struggling to do consistently so for me i've finally finished the second week of this couch to 5k and i've tried and tried and tried like over the months and i just keep letting it go however now i really feel like i've overcome that pain threshold and i just wanted to talk to you about that because it's not just about running it's about anything that you're wanting to do there's always this kind of resistance fear or um physical pain or mind pain or whichever and um one of my amazing friends and mentors from years ago once said to me um rebirth is painful that's why babies cry and i just really love that because it is about a rebirth of moving into the old version of you into a different version of you um so Another phrase that I really love, which I've said before, is everyone wants sunshine, nobody wants rain, but we can't have a rainbow without a little pain. So today, I can breathe again much more easier if you've been following my five uh, Couch to 5K. Um, I'm actually really enjoying it. I'm loving the breath. And I've got this wonderful book about running and meditation. And I'm probably going to have a little read through that as well because I do find it quite meditative as well once you move through that. So it doesn't mean pushing yourself to like an extreme. Um, it's it's just about acknowledging that there will be a little bit of something that you need to push through. Um, that's something that we all need to do. Um, so I want to leave you today with a little meditation that I just did really simple the other day for myself. And I just kind of breathe through it. So every exhale, I just breathe it out through the mouth. And I just gave myself a couple of affirmations. And it's, it's really about trust, trusting yourself, trusting the flow. So if you want to sit and do that with me, let's just get comfortable. Close our eyes. It's only a couple of minutes. It's always just about a choice. So why not say yes? So take a deep breath. And release. And this time, if you want to release through the mouth, like a real a letting go. And we're not focusing on breath work today. We're just allowing the release, whatever that is. Sometimes we know what that is. Sometimes we don't know. It doesn't matter. We're not analysing it. Deeply inhaling. Just allowing yourself to let go of anything stagnant in your body, in your mind, softening your face, relaxing your face, relaxing your shoulders. And focusing either on the heart or the third eye, which is in between the eyes and a little bit further up. And allow yourself to sink a little deeper into relaxation. And now all we're going to say is whatever's coming up for me right now, whether it's an uncomfortable feeling, whether it's a situation that's happening that you're working through, whether it's a specific goal that you're just struggling to reach or even start, let's begin by shifting our mindset around this. So we're going to say, trust myself and when we say I trust myself we're saying I trust that I have the resources that I have the motivation that I can that I will and I am and I trust the universe so I trust the flow I trust what's right for me at this time in my life in this chapter I trust that things are coming up for a reason for personal development, for spiritual development. So we're going to work with those two things. I trust myself and I trust the universe. Just say that a few times and any time you need to take a deep inhale and blow that away, then do so. I trust myself. I 
trust the universal flow. I trust myself. I trust the flow. I trust myself. I believe in myself. And I trust the flow. I trust myself. I trust the universal flow and divine timing. And I trust myself. I trust myself. I trust myself. And then slowly just blinking the eyes open, coming back to the here and now, just allowing yourself to pause every now and then and just again your rebalance, your connection to yourself. For those of you that are joining me for the next 10 day reset of twice daily meditations and lots of support and other videos, then I will see you tomorrow night at eight. So have a lovely, lovely rest of your weekend, whatever you're doing and bye for now.